Kalu dodal, Sinhalese, Tamil, total is a sweet dish, a type of dodal that is popular in Sri Lanka. The dark and sticky dish consists mainly of kithal jaggery from the sap of the toddy palm, rice flour and coconut milk. Kalu dodal is a very difficult and time-consuming dish to prepare. The Hambanthota area is famous for the production of this dish. Origins and history Kalu dodal is believed to have been introduced to Sri Lanka by Malay migrants, perhaps from Indonesia. It has also been attributed to the Portuguese, who occupied parts of the country during the 16th and 17th centuries. With the introduction of artificial ingredients in recent times, the preparation of kalu dodal has occasionally deviated from the traditional recipes. Kalu dodal, along with other traditional sweets, is commonly prepared and consumed in celebration of the Sinhala New Year. As the process of making the dish is difficult and time-consuming, nowadays most people don't make kalu dodal themselves, instead preferring to buy it from shops. Kalu dodal capital The Hambanthota area in southern Sri Lanka is famous for kalu dodal, and is sometimes referred to as the kalu dodal capital. The Kalu Dodal industry is a major source of income for many people in the area. The Kalu Dodal shops in Hambanthota are frequently visited by pilgrims coming to visit the nearby holy town of Kataragama. In 2011, the Sri Lankan government allocated 134 million rupees for setting up Kalu Dodal sales centers in the Hambanthota area, in an effort to develop the industry. Description the main ingredients of kalu dodal are kithal jaggery from the treacle of the Caryota arens plant, rice flour and coconut milk. Other ingredients such as cashews, cardamom and raisins may be added. It is dark brown in color and is a thick, sticky and sweet jelly-like dish with a slightly granulated texture. To make the dish, the kithal jaggery and thin coconut milk is mixed and boiled in a large pan until the mixture is reduced to half the original amount. The rice flour, thick coconut milk and the rest of the ingredients are then added. It is necessary to continuously stir the mixture while simmering, to prevent it from burning and sticking to the pan. The oil that floats to the surface of the mixture must also be repeatedly removed. Once the mixture becomes thick, it is poured into a tray, pressed, and left to cool. This labor-intensive process can take up to 9 hours. The firm kalu dodal is cut into pieces before serving. References